welcome to Chelsea. How does it feel to be sat here today? Thank you, thank you. Yeah, very happy, uh, excited. Will be a fantastic journey. And yeah, exciting to start as soon as possible. Tell us about your first week at the club. How important has it been to, to get, you know, your surroundings and, and the people at Cobham and at Stamford Bridge? Yeah, it's been quite busy. Uh, it's normal at the beginning. It's always in the same way. You know, you try to know all the people around the training ground, uh, some of the players that they were already there. But uh, yeah, the feeling is fantastic. You mentioned the players. It is a squad full of talent and personality. How excited are you to work with them on a day-to-day -day basis? Very excited. Uh, one of the reasons uh, I'm here is because I'm convinced that the, the squad is very good. As you said, it's full of talent. So the most important thing now is that uh, we are able to create the right culture that drive us uh, through the season. I always said the same. If you are able to improve players, that means that you improve the team. So it's our target to try to, to improve all of them day by day. And we saw last year, obviously, with the incredible success at Leicester, the style of play is so important to your philosophy, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. I think every manager has the, their own idea uh, or style. The mind is uh, it's quite clear. Uh, yeah, as you said, last year was very good, but it's already, it's already finished. Now, new chapter, uh, new squad, new club. And yeah, very happy to be here. And you bring with you such a winning mentality from what you've achieved. How important is that moving forward? It's the main point. It's the main point because when you join a club uh, like Chelsea, uh, you have to know that uh, it's a club that uh, has to win. So the, for us, we're going we're gonna to try to do our best to be there, at least to, to fight and to compete with uh, that club that in this moment they are winning and and they are there fighting to win titles. Throughout your career as a player and as a young coach, Enzo, you've worked with so many big personalities, big managers. Yeah. Has that helped to shape you as a coach? Absolutely. Uh, it's, yeah, as you said, uh, Ancelotti, Lippi, Pellegrini, uh, most, yeah, all, all of them very important managers. I think we all try to take things and then we create our own you know, box with all these things in th inside. And this is what I, I try to do since I start to think to be manager. And here at Chelsea, we have a rich history of Italian players and, and managers. I know you're smiling yeah. at that. that. Has that helped you know, with regards to your decision and, and coming here and the idea of building a legacy of your own? Um, I'm, yeah, one of the reasons for sure. I'm very proud to be, again, one Italian manager again here. Probably there is something between Chelsea club, Chelsea family and Italian people that uh, works well. <laughs> You've spoken about those relationships and also the importance of culture. With that in mind, how important is it to build a bond with the Chelsea supporters between the players, the coaches and the fans? In this moment for me is the, you know, when you join a club, you always try to analyze and what the club or the team needs to, to improve and to do the right things. And for me, it's quite clear we need to, to create as soon as possible the right mentality, the right culture, and culture that the fans, they can be proud of the team. Eh? So this is very important. We're going to try to be an aggressive team on the ball and off the ball. And we need to create this connection uh, between the fans and the club, and especially at home. Uh, when you have your own fans behind the team pushing, it's like to play with uh, 12 players. And this is what we have to create here. Absolutely. And speaking of Stamford Bridge, obviously we saw you in the away dugout last season. What will it mean to you personally to, to yeah. walk out of that tunnel for the first time? I just said I feel very proud. I consider Chelsea one of the biggest clubs in the world, so uh, I feel very proud of it. Things obviously change next week with all the players returning for, for pre-season, most of them, of course. How big a part of your plan is it to get people out on the pitch as soon as possible to really sort of get that, that message across? It's very important. It's important because we need to know each other. I already know all of them, to be honest, because I watched so many games in the last two or three weeks. So I know all of them. It's always different when you spend the day by day with the person. You know, you, know, you, you can see them through games, but then when you spend the day by day with the players, with the human being, with the person, you receive different kind of feelings. So it's very important to start Monday. And as I said, I'm very, very happy, very excited. 
And finally, Enzo, what message would you give to Chelsea fans watching this right now? How excited should they be? Oh, just trust the, the process, trust the idea, being behind the team. And for sure, we're going to join the, the journey. That is not uh, like, uh, like uh, every club, every manager. It will be not uh, easy because there is nothing easy. But for sure, we're going to enjoy our journey. And we wish you luck. Thank you very much.